Okay, I'm off for another, yes, another day on Scotty's boat. At the moment, it's very sunny. I've got my sunscreen, but the weather is very questionable. I reckon it's going to crack later, so we're going to go for a quick fish. For those of you who are watched from overseas, I think there's about four people from America, maybe uh, three from Canada, two from England. And there's one, one person that watches from Thailand. Masks are back in Australia, you'll be pleased to know. In case you thought that Omicron had skipped Australia, it is not. It's here, fully fledged, in full Technicolor for everybody to enjoy. Okay, ready to rock. As you can see, I've got my flippers, because that's how I roll these days. The rods are out. Bentley! Hello! How are you, gorgeous? Look at this, oh, whatever you call that. Look at that plastic fish. That's the skipper. He's just having an early morning breakfast because when you go fishing for a big day, it's important to get some bacon and eggs in you. What are you doing today, Maddie? You coming out okay. fishing? Who are you Who? prosecuting today? Me. Uh, we don't prosecute, we defend. That's right, you're a defense attorney. Nailed it. Well, there's my spare undies. I'm gonna take you out. You never know when you need a pair of spare no, undies. No. The most undies I've had in my car are 11 pairs. It's 11 pairs. It's a ball knot. That's cool. How did you learn that? From YouTube. It's amazing what you can find on YouTube these days. You can even find me. What's it for? Doesn't you have to get a line to them. Put the weight on the end of the road. So where are we going, Scott? Down to Tunks Park boat yeah. ramp? Yeah, yeah. We just arrived at Tunks Park boat ramp and I spotted a couple of police officers doing a bit of a pro promo thing with a brand new WRX. Yep. This lady's been cleaning up rubbish around the area on her kayak. I do a free clean up bug on my vlog. So we're heading for the Spit Bridge, you can see that behind us. And I can see that beautiful charter boat, Lumix, is uh, just getting ready for it to head out. She's too high to fit under the bridge, so it's obviously waited for that bridge opening time. We're going to go in for a closer look at these old, I think they're 1800s or 1900s shacks. So we're out in the middle of the harbour. What's happening, Mr. Scott? Well, we're on, what, what are we on? Sour and fucking something reef. Sour and chicken reef? Sour and chicken eat. reef. We're going to like put a prawn on the hook. Oh, can I have a look? Uh, straight up your shit up. <laughs> the shit up. Oh my gosh. We'll push it around, feed it around. We've got, we've got a three foot flatty. Oh. It's a baby flatty, flathead, isn't it? Yeah. I didn't know they came that small. It's so exciting. So what happened, Scott? We're, are we going to keep that one or not? No, mate, it's too small. She's going back in? She's gone. So we're doing some ethical fishing today. We, we don't. I don't, I don't know. No, I'm going to scrap that because there's nothing ethical about it. Oh, so this whole monologue is going to be scrapped. He was too small. Can you Google that? Legal limit for flathead. I'm gonna go with three meters. Yeah, 36, 36 centimeters for the legal limit for head flat, 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 flat back. Flat, flathead. There goes the May Gibbs. She's getting dark out there. Alright folks, 
So we're out in Sydney Harbour, not having a great deal of luck with uh, the fish. We caught a three metre flatty, but it was a baby, uh, so Scott put him back. If you see over my left right shoulder, if yeah, you can right. see behind me, those storm clouds, they're slowly rolling in. It's looking pretty gunmetal charcoal, fucking blue Black. still dark out there. You see I'm an experienced sailor, so these sorts of massive waves, these troughs, they don't, they don't phase me at all. I was born in the water, like a little tadpole. <laughs> <laughs> the bath water. They should have taken me out with the bath water as well, shouldn't they, Scott? I don't know if I told you this before, but I'm out with my friend and uh, colleague Scott. Uh, we both work at the, at the same place. Look, I don't talk about my work much. Sometimes it takes a bit of an emotional toll on, on folks like us, so we have to we have to find a way to decompress. Scott's way of Scott's way of decompressing is by bullying harmless little fishy creatures. Whatever does it for you. Me, I'm just happy to be out on the water. Thanks for tuning in. Hold on boys, we're sailing into some adverse weather conditions! I'm not gonna lie, the weather took a bit of a turn for the worse. Ooh, she's rainy! Where are you going? Good fun though. Fucking great fun. Good fun. Alright, well, I think that's a wrap for today. <laughs> Look at me. I'm like a drowned rat. Thanks for tuning in. Hopefully we'll have some better weather next time. And uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Laters.